Ooh, this next story has me so intrigued. This is certainly something you don't hear every day. Two local women say that they have uncovered hidden secrets about a pirate, a pirate that faked his own death and moved to Lincoln County. And they say that these findings are so groundbreaking that they decided to write a book about it. WCNC Charlotte's Chris Mulcahy shares the story. When you think of a pirate story, of course, you think it's on the seven seas, but not this one. The ending of this pirate story actually takes place right here in Lincolnton. Lorenzo Ferrer was a man who came to Lincolnton in 1839 under very mysterious circumstances. Who many people had said from day one was the pirate Jean Lafitte. Ashley Oliphant and Beth Yarborough spent over two years investigating the mystery of this local legend and found some amazing truths. We discovered that Jean Lafitte faked his death in the 1820s in the Caribbean. From there, he hid in Cuba and then moved to Mississippi under the name Lorenzo Ferrer and later was convinced to move up to Lincolnton, North Carolina. From the day he arrived until the day he died in 1875, to our knowledge, Mr. Ferrer never worked a single day. As they were writing a book on Jean Lafitte, they decided to do some further digging on this local lore. We began finding all sorts of things that had never been found and quickly realized this was the book. Their book, Jean Lafitte Revealed, shows pages of their findings proven by primary documents, connecting him to Mississippi via his mistress, Louisa, for the first time. They even tracked down this sword connected to the notorious pirate. We were able to come in and examine the sword, and that is when we discovered that it was Jean Lafitte's sword because his name was inscribed on the iron scabbard. If you want to read more about code names, gold, and the pirate's tale, we have more on the story and how to get the book on WCNC.com. With WCNC Charlotte, I'm Chris Mulcahy. That is so fun. I loved hearing about that. And I wonder if there's any gold buried around those parts. I guess that's the next adventure.